Yo, what is up? Joshua Casper here with another WordPress tutorial. This one's on using the contact form 7. Uh, for some people it causes an issue and that has to do with a bunch of complicated things, but essentially the emails aren't being sent. Uh, WordPress thinks they're being sent and then some of the mail servers out there in the internets just, uh, they, just they just go into wherever lost emails go. Uh, but I'm going to show you how to fix it so we can use, continue to use the contact form 7 inside of our um, our theme one engine and you can also use this if you're using contact form 7 in a different theme as well but this is the workaround to get it right. Uh, we're going to add a new plugin easy WP SMTP Easy WP SMTP. We search for that. There it is. Install. Okay. And now what we're going to do is when it sends from WordPress, it's going to go get routed through our, my Gmail. And that's where I all of my business accounts, that's where I want everything to go anyway. So uh, it's, it's a good choice for me. Uh, there, you can also use, I think, Yahoo and some other ones as well. And I'll show you the help page that will show you, uh, tell you which mail servers you can use. Uh, if you say please visit, it, you should definitely go visit it. You know what I'm saying? Although earlier today this wasn't working, so I'm not sure if it's back yet. But what we're going to do is set up the from email address. And I'm going to use this from Joshua at joshuacasper.com. See, the page isn't working, so I'll just have to use the settings from my other um, WordPress blog. From Joshua Casper, that's me. And then SMTP host. And if you're going to use Gmail like me, it's smtp.gmail.com. Cool. The encryption there is SL, SSL. The port is 465, and you want to use authentication always, yes. And then this is your Gmail username or email, and the password you use to get into Gmail. So, and save changes. And now that it's saved, this should be all set up to send email from this subdomain on my, my website to uh, my Gmail account. So let's see if it works. And you can just use the testing and debugging settings to uh, Joshua Casper 22, subject, test, STMP, test, Playboy. And let's see if it worked. Okay, so it says the test mail was sent, was sended, <laughs> and uh, we need to go to the uh, the test. We tested it to my Joshua Casper 22 at Yahoo, and it looks like it's already showed up. Cool test. So now what we want to do is go back to the actual website and use the contact form here to see if it worked. Uh, name. Awesome DJ 101. And let's just say now I'm going to use the Yahoo mail just so. Da, 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 da. And this is a test. Only a test. And let's hope, oh, cross your fingers. And it says it was sent successfully and it's already come up in the Gmail. So that's the workaround for the um, settings here. I know that this uh, particular theme uses Contact Form 7 and it's really difficult to try to change that around. It's embedded in the uh, actual setup of it, but uh, if you're using com uh, Contact 7 Form, this is a workaround for any theme, but for this theme in particular. And uh, I've been doing 
tutorials on this theme for a while now, so I figured I'd make sure you guys are going to get your mail. Anyway, I hope that helped, and we will see you next time. Peace.